briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1959 patent dispute, Fitzgerald v. Arbib, the United States Court of Customs and Patent Appeals, had to determine the priority of invention for a design patent for an ornamental escutcheon plate for a lock. Following the doctrine of priority of invention, the court needed to decide which party was the first to reduce their invention to practice or file a patent application. The Board of Patent Interferences initially awarded the priority to Arbib et al. Fitzgerald, the junior party, appealed, claiming he had completed the design before Arbib et al.'s filing date. However, the court agreed with the board's decision that Fitzgerald's evidence was only of conception, not an actual reduction to practice, as a physical embodiment of the design was necessary. In determining the priority of invention, the court evaluated the reasonable diligence of both parties during the critical period before the filing date. Fitzgerald, whose application was co-pending, did not demonstrate reasonable diligence in reducing the invention to practice during the critical period or at any time between June and December 1954. The court did not consider Fitzgerald's actions after December 1954 as they took place after Arbib et al.'s filing date. Ultimately, due to the evidence lacking a reduction to practice and Fitzgerald's failure to establish reasonable diligence during the critical period, the court upheld the Board of Patent Interference's decision and awarded priority of invention to Arbib et al. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.